Hi friends, today we are going to talk about how we can call a transaction code in in Fury. So this is very important because lots of time with S4 HANA, lots of time the infrastructure team is saying that we are not going to install SAP GUI. So in this case, you will be using some transaction codes in some point. So how you can enable that? Okay. So first thing is you have to go to the Fury Launchpad. You, if you type in this transaction code from the back end, or you open the Fury Launchpad in your system, it will show up. And now here, there's an easy way. Here you just search, do a search here, and again based on your, based on the uh, the the network speed, the speed will improve or it will go down. Okay. So here, if you see, I will just type in business partner. Okay. Because this this transaction code, it call, this particular Fury app, it just calls a, a transaction code in S4. Okay, so now at this point, it's basically calling the SAP NetWeaver portal. Now, you might want to enter another transaction code here, but that you you cannot enter here. So what you will do, you go to GUI action settings, go to settings here. Okay, and what you do is show key code. And you just click on save. Okay. The moment you save it. Okay. And now you see the wonderful place where you have the transaction code you can do. And here I will just try, type in ME2L, suppose. Okay. And I press enter and boom, I'm into it. So this is very helpful. And this is a quick, uh, qu quick use case where you can enable the transaction code for SAP uh, for, from Fury. Thank you and have a good day.